I'm here at Telnor Connection Stand together with Per and Andrea. Per, first of all, what is Connected Services? Connected Services is basically a connection between a product and a server to extract some data from that product, which is useful either for the manufacturer of the product, for the user of the product, or for society at large. Could you please give us a short account of the development of one such connected service? Yeah, absolutely, I can. One very important thing for connected service is connecting the car. And that's why we're standing in front of a Volvo and we're cooperating with them. It's our customers since over 10 years. And they evolve from very basic services like emergency service coming out if you have an accident automatically and transfer on your location as well as um, yeah, to get a dealer appointment. But more information as well, that you can remotely activate, for example, your heater when Sweden is that cold and you want to not go in a cold car, but in a warm one. But it's evolving for backseat services with bigger bandwidths like um, internet streaming, internet radio. It's a very involvement where we supported it with a design right from the start to be able to evolve and stay competitive. And what is the key to success when connecting products? The key is definitely flexibility, future-proof, and definitely designed from the start. Um, you must be open to barriers. Open standards is very important, I would say, to enable the um, connectivity society and to bring it to more mass market approach. ECAF is one of our solutions which opens a connectivity framework where you can um, connect different devices to it, very easy cost reduction, cost uh, by development and also easy bring to market, but you still don't lose the flexibility. You are talking about an end-to-end -end approach and a life cycle view of connected services. Why is this important? Well, you can imagine if you buy a car, for instance, a car would last for like 10 or 15 years and you want to make sure that the connectivity package you have inside that car stays modern during the life cycle of the car. So it's important then that you make all the right choices when you're implementing this communication from the start. And this is what we're cooperating closely with the manufacturers of the cars and also manufacturers of all other kinds of products with from the beginning to make sure that it gets right for the long term. You claim to help customers stay competitive. How? Well, by being flexible, because we understand that these services will evolve over time. So we want to build that flexibility in from the beginning. And that's why we also here at the booth are demoing different ways of being flexible so that the customer will feel that the car stays modern during the duration of the ownership. A lot of people have visited Telenor Connection Stand today. One of them is Mr. Johan Weber, Norway's ambassador to Spain. This is the first time you're visiting the Mobile World Congress. What is your impression of the Telenor Connection Stand that you just visited? Well, I've been very impressed by what I've seen here, the high level of the technology. And I'm very pleasantly surprised, so to speak, that Norway is sort of in the head of uh, technology worldwide and that you are working very closely with global partners such as Volvo, for instance, and uh, promoting new products. And this is very promising, I think, for Norwegian technological future. Thank you.